China developing advanced modern aircraft carriers with hypersonic missiles and laser. According to DoD, China could build several aircraft carriers in the next 15 years. China may ultimately produce five ships, for a total of six carriers, for the PLA Navy. The third through sixth Chinese carriers are likely to be flat deck ships, like U.S. aircraft carriers, that utilize steam or magnetic catapults and would enable the PLA Navy to employ aircraft armed with heavier munitions intended for maritime missions. The third carrier is the Type 002 carrier. It is in development and is slated to complete in 2020 or 2021, will be a 70,000-ton aircraft carrier with catapults designed to launch heavier aircraft. China is building its fourth aircraft carrier and is expected to deploy the vessel in six years in around 2023. The Type 003 aircraft carrier could be a true supercarrier, with nuclear power and a 90,000 ton displacement. It is expected around 2030. If China can successfully carry out its Type 001A aircraft carrier program, the People's Liberation Army Navy will eventually have better carriers than its Indian and Japanese counterparts. Chinese experts believe that China's J-15 carrier-based fighter is better than India's Russian-built MiG-29. Kanwa said the Chinese fighter is still under development. The MiG-29 has been used in various aerial operations, and China admits that the J-15 will not be fully ready before 2020. Moreover, it remains unclear whether China is capable to operate the J-31, its second stealth fighter still in development, from aircraft carriers. Starting this year China will start using a new class of destroyer, the Luoyang-3. These ships are engineered with vertically launched, long-range anti-ship cruise missiles. The new destroyer will carry an extended range variant of the HHQ-9 surface-to-air missile. China has plans to grow its navy to 351 ships by 2020 as the Chinese continue to develop their military's ability to global targets. The U.S.-China Economic and Security Review Commission is now reviewing expert proposals to provide a one-time unclassified report on China's development of advanced weapons. The request for proposals seeks unclassified, open-source assessments of specific Chinese weapons systems and areas of ongoing technological inquiry. Some detailed priority areas include Maneuverable re-entry vehicles, including hypersonic glide and supersonic combustion ramjet engine-powered vehicles. Directed energy weapons, to include high-power radio frequency, high-energy lasers, and particle beam, with effects ranging from satellite jamming to target damage. Electromagnetic railguns. Direct ascent, co-orbital, and other anti-satellite missile in addition to counter-space electronic warfare capabilities, and unmanned and artificial intelligence equipped weapons. Other PLA new accusation. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe.